Wait, we need one that does this too. We had we had these lovely pictures from a couple of years ago. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the hair was blowing in our faces. There we go. Oh, whatever. <laughs> the big day's here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Everyone's at Centennial Park. Barbara Doris. Here I am, my crown. <laughs> She's a singer-songwriter, a publicist, an improv comedian, a mom. The sun's in my eyes. Don't worry about it, you're in it. And this is a day for her to see the people who met her most through all those avenues. You recognize me? Yeah. <laughs> Some she hasn't seen in 20, 30 years. Alpha Delta Pi sisters from Tennessee Tech University. I've got a lot of college friends and a lot of high school friends, old boyfriends. <laughs> Barbara's been planning all of this since a day late last year. I went into the hospital because I had pain. I had seven Vanderbilt angels standing over me and, and they said, uh, ma'am, were you aware that you have a four inch tumor, you know, under your right rib cage? And I said, no. Barbara says she has an inoperable cancer and was told back then she had six months to live. Which would be about two weeks from now. So. I started to laugh and I thought, well, I'll, I'll throw a party and I'll either be there or I won't. Barbara says she knows it's different. It's a funeral. But she's never been interested in what's normal. You, you heard that? <laughs> I have never been to a funeral before. A funeral, that's, that's new. Plus it's cheaper than a funeral. <laughs> 150 bucks for a shelter, bam, you're done. <laughs> this is what she calls the visitation. I was hoping I'd catch you standing up. I was going to come over and just <coughs> give you a big old hug and a kiss. Aww. I guess we all process things in our own way, and I'm going to embrace her way. But Barbara says no matter how much time she awesome. really has left, Thank you. that strength comes from the people surrounding her. <laughs> I just pray, Lord, for miracle working. I don't feel alone in this. Definitely, not for a second. Courageous woman. And I've never felt more cared for or protected. I'm just grateful to be alive. We come to you with bowed heads and humble hearts. We know, Lord, that you're going to keep our lovely friend here as long as you want her here. And when you get ready for her, Lord, then you're going to bring her on home. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Everybody, come on, say amen. amen. Let's go. I just could not be afraid. I don't know how else to put it. I've just, I've been in good hands from the very second this started. I love you, I love you too. We love you, Barbara. I love you too. If you love somebody, hug them and let them know, because you never know how much time you have left.